Good evening guys, this will be a uh, uh, reassessment of the uh, light meter uh, measurements of the uh, Osram Cold Blue Intense Next Gen at 3 meters away. At this moment, uh, at this particular height, we see uh, the um, uh, fluctual and uh, measurements are around 2980 lux. Uh, let's see uh, if I go up and down, um, if we will have a uh, uh, significant change in this measurement because I uh, I really want to bring you the most uh, accurate measurement possible. You see right here, I have the um, roller set straight into the uh, wheel of the uh, car, and from there up to here, right at 300 centimeters. It's the uh, are the two foot, the two stands uh, of the tripod. Two of them. Okay, so let's see if uh, we will have any significant change if I cover it up. The number decreases and when I take it off we see it go up again so on the other side 2960 let's see if I can change this <laughs> without um, with only one hand it's a bit hard, but I will try. I have to try to uh, not move it at all. So if we go up, basically the, the tripod remains pretty much still. If we go up, the uh, number decreases. We see it decreased at 2370. So at this height, uh, the light meter is above the uh, spot where the, these halogens reach their maximum brightness. I will take it down again one go and we see the uh, numbers increase already so 296 let's see if I go a bit down more if the number will increase and no you see right there again it's the area where we have uh, less light as I go down And if I go even down, of course, the measurements, the numbers will decrease. So basically, uh -huh. and one more. Basically, at this. Um, length at three meters I have to make four uh, four turns with the lever 2960 and of course up it, uh, it decreases So let's take it back again, just like that. 
let's set the max reading. And yeah, pretty much this is it. Um, I will use this new reading for the uh, 3 meters um, light meter test. It's still uh, above the, uh, the one I measured for the Racing Vision GT200, but keep in mind uh, when I did that, it was the first measurement. Um, I also added a uh, concrete tile to the uh, uh, wheel of the car and after that I placed the uh, roller. So basically uh, the Racing Vision GT200 was measured at around um, 3 meters and uh, 20 centimeters, 3.2 meters. So that means I will have to redo the 3 meter uh, Racing Vision GT200 test and also I will add the um, uh, Extreme Vision Pro 150 3 meter light meter test with this occasion. It will take me a couple of days more but uh, I really want to bring you the most accurate measurements possible. Let's see if uh, where is that spot? Where we have that uh, maximum reading. Oh, here we have it. <laughs> so yeah, it really goes up to, to 300. It's really strange. But I guess in this case it matters also um, the fact that the halogens uh, are up and running for a longer time. So they, uh, they heat up and of course they will output a, a higher number. Let's see exactly what this will be. So max. 301 This is about it Let's cover it up once again So yeah, it really and set the max reading And yeah, that pretty much is it. <laughs> 301. So right here. Okay, so this will be the uh, the final result. Basically, uh, 3,010 locks. and uh, 270 foot candela. 
you can imagine each reading has a uh, um, margin of error so anyway the the readings are close to to what I measured uh, yesterday but um, I will uh, I will keep these ones since uh, I really uh, invested a l longer time in uh, this particular measurements measurement three meters so the end result is uh, 270 foot candela no matter how I take it down or up it doesn't change it doesn't go higher in uh, in the number you can see right here so this is as good as it gets and uh, 301 uh, 3010 actually lux again no modification there either Okay, let's see that three three hundred and one. But yeah, you saw it. I uh, I will I will use it just like uh, just like that. Okay, it's really sensitive. So the max foot candela and locks. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best and take care wherever you are.